Hey y'all, hey, it's Nish, your online sis, and this is another weekend vlog. It is October 30th, no, it is October 29th, and I just, I mean, got off work, y'all, it's 5.02. I was like, clicker, I'm out. I'm on my way to my mama's house right now to drop off some candles I bought for her. After that, of course, I'm gonna come back and get dressed for date night. And we're going to Fish City Grill because somebody gifted us with a gift card and <laughs> I'm excited about free food, amen. It's been a long work week. I thought this week was going by fast at first, but after Wednesday, it just started to slow down. God is good, he's brought me through another week. And we're gonna make this weekend worth it, amen? All right, y'all, so I'm gonna get ready real quick for date night. I was just telling Chris how you can feel the time change or the time is about to change. Even though we gain an hour, it feels later right now. Alexa, what time is it? The time is 7.13 p.m. I don't know, it just feels later to me, but I guess it's about to get worse because we're about to gain an hour. So we're gonna keep it real simple. I don't think I ever do like really like complicated makeup. I had to be like in the mood, like a, the mood mood to do stuff like that. Oh, y'all are really up close and personal. Can we move y'all back? Let me move y'all back a little bit. Is that better? That's probably better. I hope I'm not too blown out, but. Christopher, say good evening to the people. Good evening. I don't know what I'm gonna eat when we go to Fish City Grill, but I'm not in the mood for fried food. But I'm not in the mood for seafood, I mean for a boil either. Maybe I'll just have some gumbo, babe. Now what else can I get to make me full though? All right. Babe, I think I'm gonna put the Christmas tree up pretty soon. I'll just... Does that make you joyful? It don't make you joyful? No, it's actually annoying because I'm trying to talk to you. Okay. Did you say watch this? <laughs> oh, I'm putting this on tape. He said watch this with a swag like he was about to do something for you. Watch this, watch this. <laughs> That's so ugly. Saw my daddy and my mommy. They're good. Mama was showing me all the stuff that she made. Why do you want to put up the Christmas tree? Is that why you said that? No, I want to put the Christmas tree because I'm just in the holiday mood, but. In the holiday mood, girl, I'll just hey, you hey, hey. just like I told Kim. Hey. We ain't tasted over here. I'm just holiday. saying the holiday mood. I didn't say nothing about the weather. Christmas tree, I'm certain this Christmas. Come on, Chris, sing with me. You don't know how long? I don't know that particular song. Oh. I know he sang it all. You're not a true fan, man. I'm not. Never said I was. I thought she was, man. Mm -hmm. Y'all comment below if y'all are a fan of Home Alone 1 and 2. I don't know about 3, but it's 1 and 2. Chris, you Chris, you like Home Alone 1 and 2. Why are you acting like you don't watch that? What's your favorite, Chris? Oh, you ain't no fan. I didn't, I don't, I'm not a fan. What's I your, like it, though. What's your favorite Christmas uh, movie? Uh, I don't have one. Okay, I'm done with this conversation. Girl, my favorite Christmas. Chris ain't got nothing to do with no movie. My favorite Christmas story is. Oh, I know one now. Oh no 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 no! Christmas you don't have wife. no. You don't have no favorite Christmas story. Wife. You only saw it a couple of times. I saw it once. You just showed Y'all, let me tell y'all something. It was good. <laughs> Chris is 35 years old and only saw Preacher's Wife once. <laughs> Girl, that movie was corny for. Like, uh, wait a minute. For a man, a man Preacher's like, wife is not corny. Nah, a man should be like, man, I, have He's you just seen Preacher's that wife? He feel left behind. Nah, ain't no man gonna be like, hey man, you seen Preacher's wife? Like, we not gonna be like. What, what does that gotta do with anything? Nah, cause I'm saying like a man ain't feel, ain't really into Preacher's wife. And really, if you ask any man, if you do a survey, reason why he probably watch Preacher's wife, either one because of his wife or because his family made him. It ain't what one about choice. Sweetheart, I don't think it is man, a family, it's I don't a family think man film. Said now, turn on Preacher's Wife and say, Yo, I'm about to check out this movie. No. With his family, I bet you did. It's a family movie. It was initiated by the woman. So, what? Initiated. I do survey online. Baby, that sounds so silly. But ain't nobody watching, ain't no, man, ain't nobody watching the Preacher's Wife, man. Any real. But why are you saying it like that? 
I'm saying it's like, not even a woman's movie. It's about a family. And I just said it was more than my Christmas. It's about movie, a marriage you know? that needs a little bit of restoring, restoration. I mean, yep. And the reason Wait, why the, I like it. What's the right term? Because it was like some funny parts in it. And then that little girl, her faith touched my heart. So that just, that's what did it. I'm thinking about the spiritual aspect of it. Yeah, but you did all that talk right now. You said Preacher's was your favorite Christian movie. I, I didn't say favorite. Yeah, you did. No, well, I'll take it back. You said oh, what's wow. my favorite. I was like, well, I guess I'm, yeah, I guess I did say that. Because I said Preacher's Wife. Because I, I can't think of nothing else. Well, Home Alone and One, one and Two will always I'm about be. I'm movie from Netflix. A classic. Babe, what is it called, babe? Babe, we really enjoyed that movie. I did, but what is it called? What's called? Oh, Ooh, what is it called? I'm be honest. Anything with yeah. Felicia Rashad in it, I'm a fan of. Facetime Trinwin. What did you say? Trinity. Yes, ma'am. What is the name of the Christmas movie that came out last year? Everybody was like, it was popping. Jingle jangle. Jingle jangle. Oh, you did. Uh, yeah, you want to say hi? Hey, y'all! Yes, the box. Hey, I just wanted to see who you were talking to so passionately. Where are you going? I'm at the studio, so I'll call you back. Oh, bye. Jingle Jangle, y'all. That's the movie. That's the movie right there. You remember, all, you remember all the music? That was good because I'm oh, because that's what's the name Let me music. make sure you're not in the picture. Oh, you're not. The, the, uh, Hamilton's was singing. The who? Hamilton's. Anthony Hamilton's uh, background thing. Oh, gotcha. They perform their own group called the Hamilton. Oh, you're so smart. You're so smart and knowledgeable. Okay, don't play with me. Hamilton's kind of sound weird, though, I'll be honest. It doesn't sound weird if you knew where they came from. We got the Hamilton's, like. If you knew where they came from, it don't sound weird. I understand the play on the word, babe. It's still cheesy. Yeah, they can really sing, too. I I'm not taking that credit from them. I'm just saying the name needs to be revamped. I feel like I just got bit by something. Uh-uh. Don't do bugs and bites. That's, that's like even with the TV mm -hmm. show. And you like that movie with Queen Latifah? What movie? The one where she thought she was gonna die. Hey, I would make that my movie. Okay, Chris. That movie is actually funny because when she go to church, why me, Lord? <laughs> why in heaven's me? That part was funny. <laughs> But I don't think it was supposed to be funny. Like when she this sung, you, oh when God, she sung, when she sung, why in heaven's me? That wasn't supposed to be funny. Was. She was crying for her life. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. So I'm about to finish getting ready. I have to brush my hair out real quick, real quick. Babe, are you almost dressed? I'm getting hungry. Y'all, let me tell y'all something about this wig now. Which I don't know is I'm about to switch this up. So yesterday I did a poll on my Instagram to ask like what people think like if I should stick with the ash blonde for now or do I switch? Y'all, I promise it feels like okay. I'm gonna stop saying this, but it feels like I got bit right here. And all. So I did a poll on Instagram and asked y'all if I should stick with the ash blonde or the jet. And I want to be. If I'm not mistaken, I think Ash Blonde won. But then when I asked Chris, because you know, he my husband, he got to look at me every day, amen. He was like, oh, you know, just he said, I do, he loves Ash Blonde, but he was just like, you know, let's just change it up for black for now and then go back to Ash Blonde. So I'm like, okay, cool. Let me show y'all. So, oh wait, that ain't it. Where is it at? So I purchased the, um, Letitia wig, it looks like this. It's very, very full. Now it's not gonna look like that on me. We're gonna tame it the right way, but I got this in a 1B and y'all, it's gonna be so cute. I've been wearing this unit for a month now. I had an account like, cause I do weekly vlogs. So I counted all the vlogs and it was four weeks ago that I wore, I wore this unit. So, all right y'all, I think I'm done. I just need to put a belt on and put some perfume on. See y'all at Fish City Grill.
good morning. It is 7 a.m. and I'm up because I have to be at Lock and Terra at 9 a.m. for my first photo shoot. So I have two photo shoots. I have like one mini photo shoot. Then I have another one with Pastor Show who y'all met like on, if it wasn't last vlog, it was a vlog before last. No, it was the last vlog. Wait, no, no, the vlog before last. It's gonna be a day and I wanted to make some iced coffee. I just used the Dunkin' Donuts coffee and I refrigerated it overnight. And then I just add sweet cream to it in the morning. So I need to charge this battery. So I'm gonna charge my battery now. <laughs> I'm gonna take a shower and get ready so we can be on time, child. Cause I have to be on time. I'm gonna enjoy my iced coffee, get some prayer and devotion in before I leave and hit the road. What's up, y'all? I'm tired. I am done with my photo shoot. Both my photo shoots, y'all. I've been working hard. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed the pictures, the collage I just put before this clip. I've been taking photos every weekend for the past three weeks, almost, almost a month. So, but I enjoy it. I enjoy being a photographer. I enjoy being a multifaceted creative. You know what I'm saying? But I'm on my way home. I'm gonna take a shower. I'm gonna chill out for a little bit. I think I'm gonna end up going to church. The kids are having like a trunk or treat event like in place as an alternative for Halloween. Um, so I'm probably gonna hit that up, see my church family and all that. But just want to check in and let y'all know that things are going swell. And I'm on my way home. To freshen up, so let's go. Can you say hi? Y'all, this is my friend McKK. She looks like she don't like me, but she really loves me. McKK, hey girl. Hey girl. She's not even about that life right now, guys. Hey y'all, hey, I'm about to go to bed. I look like how I look this morning, right? So crazy, not really. It's been a long day. My day started early and my day starting early again tomorrow. So I'm gonna go to bed, but before I do, I got a package in the mail. And I want to show y'all my little cute notebooks that I got. So I am like a visual, I like as far as like planning organization, and all that stuff in my life and keeping my life in order. I like to write things down. So yeah, so I just want to share with y'all, just wanted to share with y'all uh, my notebooks. To-do list tablets like this one. What I really, really like about this one is that this one actually has no dates on it. I don't know if y'all can see that. And this has like your Monday through Friday up here, I'm sorry, Sunday to Sunday up here. Then it actually breaks down like, so this is just one day. So it has your what to do today list here. Then it has a list that says, um, oh wait, then it has a little space up here that says what you're grateful for. And then right here, it has uh, what I need to pick up today. And then below that, it has meals and snacks, which I really need to get better at is it being intentional with what I'm cooking, what I'm preparing for dinner. And then right next to the meal of snacks, y'all see that? You can kind of keep track of your water, which I thought it was really cute. So this is just a day-to-day -day thing. I love that it's not marked. So like if I skip a day or whatever the case may be, I don't have to worry about wasting paper. And then this tablet is kind of the same thing. It's a daily to-dos. So it's not like your typical traditional planner, which I really, I don't know why I enjoy it so much, but I really, really like it. So it's basically a book version. I really like the print too. It's like a brown goldish tin with uh, black leaves on it. Really simple, like I always like. But each 
page is just like the tablet. Just not as colorful. Can y'all see that? So it has the days up here, little sections here, to-do list here. I really like it. Really, really like it. Oh, and then it has times to remember at the bottom. Times to remember right here and then right here. It actually has a section for fitness. So I love that too. Definitely gonna put this in use right away because I'm going to need it, my dear. I look so rough, y'all. I've been real rough on my channel. That's how y'all know, y'all family. When I stop caring, that's when you know. But I will see y'all tomorrow morning. Oh y'all, my hair is big, but I love it. I love this texture of this hair. But anyway, um, it look like it's mine, right? Let me show y'all the scalp. Look at this part. Look at this. Look. Lace wear. Anyway, so we just got out of church and we're about to go get some Popeye's chicken, y'all, because I can't think of nothing else to eat. Mm -hmm. We're not craving anything. Chris is over there getting mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's see, look at it. It's tripping. Mm -hmm. And his mm -hmm. butter nice. Don't get frustrated, Chris. Let's see what he does. Let's see what he does. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Trinity, are you nervous? I'm scared. You don't got the camera on me. I'm so scared. Trinity is nervous. Her tickets for her for her dance recital go live. I don't know if I ever told them the story. Tell them about EOD. No, I can't tell them right now. My stomach is turning. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Her tickets are about to go live for sale for they her. They're live right now. They're live right now. Um, but she has a dance yeah. called Essence of Dance. And she has, she, how long have you had? A year? Um, I mean, yeah, we've been active for almost a year though. And she has a huge recital that's coming up. And her tickets just went live online. If you live in the San Antonio area or surrounding areas, check it out. Go to, I don't know. She's going to give it a link. Go to eventbrite.com slash essence of dance. And you're going to see it, girl. Yeah, or she's going to give it a link and I'll make sure to put it in the description box. There go Devon. Let's go look at Devon. Now, I know I told y'all last vlog that I don't talk to him. Sometimes I don't. What am I doing? What am I doing? It depends, actually. Oh, wait. he's behaving right now, but who t who's to say what's going to happen in the next few moments? How can, why would Deja do that? Let's, let's see what Denisha's doing. Denisha, what are you over there doing? I am putting up food. Boring. <laughs> hi, Sydney. Yeah, hey, girl. Hey, say hi to YouTube or whatever. Awesome. Babe, say hi to you too. Don't he look sharp, y'all? I mean, he look like a pastor. Look at him. Child, I look like a bus hit me. This hair is so big, but I love it. Y'all like it? I had to cut it because it was way too long. But I love the texture of it. I think it's the texture of it for me. And it's the like the texture that makes it look like african-american hair but anyway i'm sorry i didn't even announce where we're coming from so we just came from denisha and davon's house had a really good time hanging out with them and now i'm just fooling around with this hair because i love it it's so big it's like beauty pageant big but because the texture just makes me feel like this is like my hair but it's really not my hair but anyway this is the leticia's wig leticia's this is the Letitia wig and I had to cut it because it came about this long and it was like real stringy down here so I cut it up and then cut bangs into it so that it could have like those big Farrah Fawcett curls. I love it. 
it is so cute but um it's about to come off of course because it's time to go to bed i'm about to do my night regimen and just wanted to say good night and close out this vlog you can see my lace wig coming up i don't even care y'all are my friends and i'm letting y'all know this is the real deal and thank y'all for always hanging out with me i just was gonna show y'all how oh this is like old makeup but where did this come from wait a minute i look an oily mess and i need to just wash my face so just want to tell y'all good night and that I love y'all and I appreciate y'all for supporting me. For those of y'all who wear lashes out there, y'all know that felt so, so good. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I hope it wasn't too short because I really feel like I didn't get a lot. But then again, I always say that and I end up with like 20 or 30 minutes worth of content. Sometimes I even have to cut it down because I have too much. Take this wig off, child, and have a good cold drink of water or juice or something and just chill out until it's time to go to bed. I'm tired, so I'm probably gonna fall asleep early tonight. Um, it's a new work week, and I'm happy about the weather cooling down, and I'm gonna be putting my tree soon. Our little baby tree. We don't have like a big, big tree because we, like, we don't have kiddos or whatever like that. It's just Chris and I right now, all right? Hopefully things will change in the future, but yeah, I just want to come and say goodnight and I love you guys so much and thank you so much for your support. If you haven't already, make sure you like this video so that it pushes your girl's content in the algorithm. If you're new to this channel, welcome. So glad that you stayed this long. You must have enjoyed yourself. And if you did, go ahead and join the tribe. Hit the subscribe button at the bottom. Join the tribe so that you'll always be alerted of when I subscribe. What? So that you'll always be alerted when I create new content for you. And then we can chit chat in the comments. And I can learn who you are. You can learn who I am. We'll just become a family. Till next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see y'all when? Next weekend. Bye bye.